What up everyone, welcome back to Remnant from the Ashes, where in today's episode we're going to be heading into the first dungeon. A little dungeon -y. Yeah, this area... It's not that difficult, honestly. Uh, this is the main enemy here, this little gremlin thing. I don't even know what the fuck to call these. Uh, the uh, more annoying counterpart is the exploding version. But... Really, it's just something we gotta get through. Oh yeah, and I think the poison fog stays. Oh, this is looking very different. Um, very, very different. Saying what it was like at all in when I first came through here. But you know, that's the beauty of this game. Uh, that each dungeon experience is gonna be a little bit a little bit different. Just enough to keep some variety. So yeah, we're gonna get through this area and see what we can do. I remember the boss of this place being an absolute Bitch. Of course. We won't know if we even get the same boss. That's the number one thing. The secondary thing, I have no idea what the hell this is. Destroy the root nexus. Oh shit. Wait, this wasn't a thing, right? Like I don't I don't remember doing this. It's possible that I did do it. What am I doing? Yeah, I forgot that melee is extremely e efficient against these things. Uh except when I'm not getting killed. Yeah, I realize I realized I was being stupid. Uh, and there was a lot more enemies than I thought. It, it is all good. Fuck. I just heard a noise. I've got a goddamn stink bug. In my room. Listen. You either live in an area that has stink bugs. Or you are extremely lucky and you live somewhere that's don't, that there isn't any. I mean, obviously there's only... <laughs> Like, that's the only two options. What the fuck am I talking about? Whatever. Sting bugs are fucking awful. And during autumn like this, slash fall, depending, uh, they're absolutely goddamn everywhere. And I don't like them. Fuck. These guys are harder to dodge than I remember. I mean, technically I can waste... Like, if I destroy this thing, I can just go back to the checkpoint, can I? So technically I could waste all my... Like, heals without worrying. I don't know if I'm doing the right thing. There's a lot of these motherfuckers. Heal, 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 heal. And actually melee is fairly good in this game. I don't know. Shit, it, it ain't being destroyed. Hmm. Oh, there is its HP. Okay, I just noticed. Ah, okay, 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 okay. I got this. I got this, that's the last death. I swear. I saw its HP bar now. This has got to be like an optional 
objective. First of all, I have a trade point. Uh, yeah, find the subway entrance. I swear there is some way to check. Uh, like ob objectives and shit. Whatever. Whatever. Okay, so the deal is... The dealio. Fuck, okay. It's not good that I'm taking this much damage. Uh, these things inflict root rot. I think that's the... That's the name of the status. It's a fairly bad one. Uh, or is it? No, actually, I think that's... Oh, shit, the tracking. It's not that bad, actually. What the fuck am I talking about? Anyways. I'm gonna give this one last shot. Get some good hits in. Listen. This is good training for how most of the bosses go in this game. That you are being chased around by a shit ton of ads. This game likes its ads for boss fights, let me tell you that. Thank you. That is all I needed. Yeah, that was an optional objective. So, if I didn't mention this before, uh, this game has a real habit. Excuse me? Oh! That's what I'm talking about. This game has a real, <coughs> real love of ads. As in, because it's co-op natured, every boss fight is fucking filled with additional enemies. It's just how it is. And I remember the first boss being particularly awful. But that might have been just because I was... Oh fuck, don't tell me this respawns. You can bet your ass I ain't killing this thing again. It does respawn. Oh shit, I also forgot I have... Yeah, I was being stupid there. Because I have my handgun heal, don't I? Okay, it does not respawn. Cool. We can finally move on. Yeah, we can get out of the first room. Sorry, you know how I am. If I set my mind on doing something. Even if it's stupid. Uh, sometimes it's difficult to stop. It's just the soul's nature, you know. Even if it's something that seems impossible. Just gotta keep grinding. I do not remember what this is. Oh shit. I do remember what this is. This stupid boss. So what deal is what the deal is? Where the fuck is he? Are these motherfuckers? Shit! I forgot his attack pattern. Oh man, this game. Fuck! What did I get myself into? Okay, I'm going to be honest with you. I I think I might have gotten myself into trouble with this hard mode. 
because I am dying a lot. In fact, I don't remember ever dying this much in the first dungeon. Which again means that I may have gotten myself into some trouble here. This might be tough. But we'll see, we'll keep on be, keep on grinding, isn't it what the YouTube people say? Maybe the thing is, oh shit, okay. Really the thing is, I do not like my current weapon. That's the, that's the main issue, I think. Oh, that's a chest. This shotgun, especially since it only has two shots. Yeah, we need to get some fucking HP. Since it only has two shots, it's like really, really limiting. And it's strong, but... I don't know why I thought this guy started off with, with like a machine gun or something. But I swear there was a class. Oh yeah. You know what, I honestly think, if I remember correctly, this doesn't do jack shit, does it? Oh, I know what it does, I remember. This doesn't even go away. Uh, what it does is every few seconds, your character will like stop and cough. And that's like the... Yeah, see so you like, get like slowed down and shit. We'll see if I have... I do. Drink it, bitch. Oh, does it offer... I'm just looking at the stats. At the bottom. This might offer protection. Cool. I've forgotten a lot of things about this game. I'll be honest with you. Just because... You didn't need to worry about a lot of things. Okay, what I'm going to do... Fuck off. These exploding assholes. Yeah. I'm gonna say, what I'm gonna do is, I'll take on the boss. But... I'm gonna like, clear out the area just in case. I think this is a pretty good pretty good spot to fight him. We got cover you know. That's what you need against this fool. I've run the fuck out of stamina. Heal. What the fuck was that? Okay, so what he does there is he goes Gwendolyn or Aldia or whatever. Summoning shit from top. Just gotta be careful. I really should be able to have this because I remember being like not really bothered by this boss. And this is what I'm talking about. I mean it technically makes sense. Is he gone? Fuck. I 
I got wiped. Literally, shit. Damn, I got machine gunned. I really might, you know, thinking now. I think I legit did get myself into a bigger challenge than I thought. I thought this would be a, a breeze on hard. But what if it ain't? What if it ain't? This is only the first dungeon too. I haven't even gotten... Technically we have gotten to a boss. Can't exactly say we've been bossless. It's all good. It's what you're here for, right? To watch a challenge. Would be no fun if I just like... Oh, I always loved that. When I streamed this game too, that was my fucking favorite. The fucking like really over the top combat role. Unnecessary too. Oh yeah, combat roll. Okay. Sorry is that motherfucker that just machine gunned the hell out of me. Wonder if the boss is gonna be now because I think he moves back every time you get like die to him. He moves back to the actual boss arena, like where he's supposed to be. Because I guess he is going to be the boss. So again, oh yeah, back to my unfinished point about the ads. Uh, I do say that technically having ads in this game makes sense because this is an ammo based game you know if a boss didn't have ads technically you'd have to find a way to constantly like drop in ammo which would be pretty weird but again that was even then probably my number one complaint of this game fuck there's a lot of you Okay, this is one situation where the auto locking does not help. But you can see how it does it. It's fairly significant and the annoying thing is when it snaps to an enemy that you are not wanting to target. That happens when there's like a lot of uh, smaller enemies kind of rushing you I do remember this room but I will have to I will have to upgrade the shit out of my weapons if I'm gonna like make it and probably armor too armor upgrades would be I'm gonna like check because if I'm playing this on hard mode I'm gonna check the shit out of the wiki. What are like the cheap weapons and the cheap armor sets? I feel like if this is how we're gonna roll, I can afford cheap. Rolling downstairs is still my favorite video game thing of all time. Like that would result in an instant neck break. Fuck, there's a lot of you. Why are there so fucking many of you? Oh, come on! Motherfuck. I, 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 call, I call bullshit on that. That was super on. That was, you know what that was? That was teleports behind you. He literally teleported behind me. And fucking offed me. Damn. That is 
quite good. This is advanced AI. That's what it would say on the back of the box. Advanced enemy AI. It'll show up behind you. Just wait for it. Man, this would be so much easier in Doom. Pop out the BF... Fuck off. Pop out the BFG. Man, that is a good game. I know that I've talked so much about Doom so far that it's probably making you think that I'd rather be playing that game, but really no. You know, some games, you gotta leave some games for your own enjoyment. And for me, Doom is that type of game. You wanna go, bitches? Hell yeah. It's how we do it. It's gonna take a while. Well, actually, no. We're almost back to where we were. I don't remember the enemy respawn logic. Because I think, like, certain special types of enemies do not respawn. Like those crossbow motherfuckers. See, like, generally, this area is, or this room is not full of enemies. Like it was before. It's like this game's little... Oh no, because it put an even more difficult enemy here. Oh, do they friendly fire each other? Okay, yeah, we're in trouble. Can you guys... Fuck off. There's one behind me. Oh, what an expert. He studied the blade. I knew you gotta be real careful of these mouth. I remember the attack pattern. He runs towards you. Yeah. But man, that dude studied the blade. This game is full of true anime. True anime lovers. Okay, it's further than I've ever been, which is, well, technically not true. All right, give me that trade point. Give me them scraps. Why do I feel like I'm missing something. <coughs> Excuse me. That was the most pathetic burp. And for your knowledge, it tasted like hummus too, which I had for dinner. I'm gonna leave you with that sliver of information, only for your enjoyment. See, I do like rooms like this. There's a blue bottleneck. Ah oh, shit. So if you don't run at it, he doesn't do the super dramatic combat roll. Oh fuck, there's a lot of you. Combat roll, come on. Shit. 
Man, it's satisfying to blast enemies in this game. Combat roll. There we go. Okay. Come to this fool again. I know his attack patterns. I heard the... The little screeching noise of enemies approaching. So I think I'm gonna cl try clearing out. There's even any... Oh, hello! I knew it! I'm stupid. I didn't follow my own advice. I said I knew. Was that was there seriously a Buddha quote there? Shit, this is difficult. Uh, what am I gonna do? What am I gonna do? I'm gonna continue. I will start. Uh, I think what I'm gonna do from now on is I'll start cutting out these like run backs if I die a lot or it's up to you guys depending you wanna hear me talk shit while trying to make it back to where I died we can we can stick with this arrangement But who knows? I mean, technically, this would be good for my leveling, right? Because if I, it's like if I'm doing like hella grinding. But man, do I need a machine gun? That's like my. It's like my thing. A machine gun. Okay, do this. Technically, you know, I will say that all the times I've died have been very creative. As in, I don't think I've died the same way twice. Which at least this game keeps it interesting. I can't exactly complain about that, can I? Fuck you. What even are these things? I never figured that out. Little bitches, that's what they are. Yeah. Definitely that. Oh shit. He has a minigun. It's a slight problem, as you can probably guess. Miniguns ain't to be fucked with. Man, does he have a lot of HP too. I don't remember if this dude reloads or is like shit overheats or something. It does, yeah. There we go. That dude has killed me before too. Coming around the corner. I had low HP to be fair, but damn, blasted with a minigun. In Doom, I'm the one doing the blasting with a minigun. How's that fair? The blaster becomes the blasty, you know. Fuck off. You just gotta, you just gotta switch games, you know. True role reversal, you know. 
How's that? It's like we're playing Dark Souls. It's how much melee. That's like more melee than I've done in my entire first playthrough, I think. Um, I was not a melee boy. I'll tell you that much. Okay, can we get to where we were? It's right here. I'm gonna try not dying. I wonder if the yeah the boss is still here. The deal with these guys is that they launch these fucking annoying ass explosive arrows. Which also leave the fucking root rot, or whatever it's called. I know I'm saying fucking a lot, but... Listen, just look at the situation here. I'm about to get killed by these little bitches. Okay, heal. And I've been watching a lot of Trailer Park Boys. Which is a good show. A lot of swearing, so... You know... The bad influence on the kids combat role. All right, bitch. What was the objective? Oh shit. Are you actually Are you serious? That was insane. I don't know what the objective was, but I did it. How do you check? Okay, I have three trade points. Um, trade info. That's what I'm going to do. And I'm going to go ahead and wrap it up here. Might need to go back and level up my shit. In fact, that's what I'm gonna do. I'll level up my shit and go back to where I just died again. And see what we can do. There won't be a boss there because he's gonna like teleport or some shit. But yeah, this is interesting. This is gonna be an interesting playthrough. Thanks for watching, boys. And like, subscribe as always. And see you next time. Peace out.